Kotobaru, where Burgess live in 55-57, is only about 50 or 70 miles from the Thai border. I mean, he explains it in his autobiography that he had considerable carnal experience of Siamese um, women. So no doubt he will have crossed the border one or more times to the border town of Takbai, I think it's called, uh, you know, to enjoy the favours of ladies of the night there, whom he described memorably as the great infectresses. In Little Wilson and Big God being the first part of the Confessions of Anthony Burgess, Burgess describes how he took his leave of Klantan, its main town, Kotobaru, in 57. He'd lived there for a couple of years. He sold his refrigerator to a Sikh and he flogged his car to a group of Klantan fishermen. He gave Matt a letter of recommendation explaining how good he was as a cook. Uh, this letter Matt simply passed on to his cousin who actually knew nothing of cooking. Uh, and Matt himself became a royal driver. The question was what to do about Lalage, Burgess's cat. He writes as follows. Lalage, now old and forgetful, went to a visiting Siamese couple who took her back to Bangkok. It was satisfying to think that after a full but virginal life, she would end her days on ancestral ground. <laughs>